Nothing more important than follow through. Any kind of sport, any kind of throwing or shooting. I'll show you what I mean. Whether you're throwing darts or shooting a basketball, whatever you're doing, you want to follow through. Okay. Adds to the muscle memory, the consistency of what you're doing. If we're uh, shooting a bow, shooting an arrow, it's uh, especially important. And I'll try to demonstrate that as well. Shooting is shooting, throwing is throwing. Regardless of what object you're propelling, uh, there's usually an element of follow through to it. With the bow, you want to hold the bow in position as you release the arrow, and you want a uh, nice follow through with your fingers. You want to release and uh, just open your fingers. Let's see if we can hit Bambi out there. Just like that. I may have dropped the bow a little bit, but I'm trying to focus on holding it as I release, not just you know shooting and then jerking everything away. We know what kinds of problems a jerking a pistol can cause. Uh, we've seen that oftentimes. That can happen to any of us, of course, the old flinch, the trigger jerk. Let's also do that while we're at it. Let's take a shot out there at old Mr. Gong with a 45. I'm going to shoot one-handed and just try. Now, you do have the recoil aspect when you shoot a handgun, of course, but you're still focusing on holding the pistol out there and following through. See if I can get that rascal. Follow through. Very important aspect, any kind of sport, any kind of throwing, kicking, you name it. So, hope that uh, was a little bit useful to you, and glad you could come by the compound today. Hickok signing off, life is good.